Hello and welcome to Adventures in VFK. This is Fairy Fanatic and I'm continuing my series on crafting. And one of the things when I was going through the tailoring book, it reminded me that I really need to do something on these specialized um, items here. This is a Halloween tea and they, they come out at different times of year with different themed um, t-shirts. And this one is really one of my favorite because they have so many options on it. The way these work is you go ahead and you use your uh, gossamer thread and I have a video on how to collect that and you make that into cloth and once you make it into cloth you can um, combine it with some other items and you can make a t-shirt uh, with a special color that's just for these particular items and also with an applique. So this kind of takes into a number of different things that we haven't really touched on yet and that is making a specialized th something out of um, you know item out of the gossamer and also doing the specialized dyeing as well as the applique. We actually have done a specialized dyeing but this is the first one we've done the applique with. So this particular thing only these Halloween teas only come in these four colors the trick-or-treat which is an orange, the monster plum which is a purple, the toxic ooze which is green and dark moon which is onyx. So let's go ahead, I have all the items to make one of these, so let's go ahead and get our items out of inventory and we can put them into a, you know, one of the, put them on one of the sewing machines. Um, this is here, it says check the book of tailoring and see we've got that open already, so we'll just hit continue. And we need to collect up the things that we're going to be using. So one of them is a gossamer thread uh, shadow. Oh, wait. Okay, we're just going to put all these things in. We've got all together we have one gossamer cloth shadow plus one gossamer cloth plus one gossamer cloth light and we have all those in and we have one gossamer thread shadow, one gossamer thread, one gossamer thread light and we need to do a pattern so this is our pattern, we'll put that in. And we also want to choose, we need to choose both one of the dye colors and also one of the appliques. Now these appliques, this is probably, this says spooky spider on it. This one here says a, a bat, a moon bat. And this is an eyeball. Oh my, a spooky face. A haunted house, spooky trees. Now there's a lot of appliques in here. I don't think I want an eyeball. I do think that the spider would be nice though, even though it's the first. Oh, maybe the moon bat. Let's go with the moon bat. So we're going to put that one in. And now we need our, one of our dye combinations. I'm kind of thinking I might go with the orange because I have plenty of the yellow and the red. So let's go with that and we'll put the dye in. And now we need, that's it. Now we just need to make it. Okay. Those are all the things that it took and this is what we got. We got our Halloween 2016 logo tee, trick or treat, moon bat girl. Okay, so now let's get this on so we can see it. Let me go in here. We have to take off a couple things and put on our shirt. Now, these patterns. Um, even the, the, because they say Halloween on them, they're only available during Halloween and when the Halloween shop is open. So you have to get your appliques then and your patterns then. So what you want to do is make sure that if you, and also, but you don't have, if you, if you weren't, didn't get any during Halloween or you weren't here for Halloween, don't worry. A lot of other people will trade for them. Um, but if you are there, then go ahead and make sure you pick up at one of everything because you just never know when you're going to want to make something really neat. Plus, it's just fun. You've got, you know, there's all kinds of special things that you can make. 
All right. Well, that's pretty much. Uh, this is my this is my Halloween tea with the moon bat on it. Isn't it? It's really cute. I love this, and it looks really good with my giraffe my giraffe uh, shorts here. So um, thank you so much for joining me. I hope you go on and do a lot of crafting on VFK because it's super fun. And if you have any questions for me, be sure you add, go ahead and just ask them on my channel. And of course, subscribe and like this video if you like it or add a comment. And I thank you for joining me. I'll see you next time. Bye.